open a Dreamcast game with Flycast. Press the F1 keyboard key. Scroll down to core options. Go to emulation hacks and turn on dump textures. Textures are dumped as you play the game. After you finished dumping the textures, you can turn off dump textures. Now go into your RetroArch folder, System folder, and there will be a new folder called DC. Inside this folder, there is a folder called Text Dump. This is where the textures from the games are dumped. The textures are separated by game folders. This is the product number of the game or the game ID, I'm not really sure. And all of the textures will be here. Some textures are dumped upside down. Import them to your image editor and rotate so it's easier to edit them but after editing them you have to turn them again to the original position. You can also upscale the image to better edit but it has to be a multiple of the original size. I already have some files to edit the textures, you can edit them however you want. Rotate the image back to the original position when you're finished. Now to save the textures, we're going to create a folder inside the DC folder called textures. Inside this folder, we're going to create another folder with the same ID name or product name as the folder in a text dump folder. The easiest way to do this is by going back inside the text dump folder and copy the name. Go back to textures and create the folder and paste the name. And now you can save your edited textures inside this folder. Don't forget to save as with the same file type as the original one. Go back to RetroArch, load the game, press the F1 keyboard key, go to the core options, emulation hacks and turn on load custom textures. If the game doesn't load them automatically, you can restart the core or if you're using save states, it should lo load the texture when you load the state. That's it for this video, thank you for watching and happy gaming.